hello welcome to this tutorial the topic is sets and in this video we'll be looking at definition and set notations so we start with uh, the definition of what a set is a set is a collection of well-defined distinct objects the objects in a set are called members or elements examples we have a collection of students in a school and every student is an element of the set also a collection of all the countries in africa and every country is an element of the set a collection of all the letters of the english alphabet and every letter is an element of the set so we look at uh, set notation a set is denoted by a capital letter while its element is written in lower case letters separated by comma and enclosed within curly brackets so for example we have a set a which comprises of elements a b c d and e and uh, symbolically we can say a epsilon a which means a is an element of a b is an element of a c is an element of a d is an element of a and e is an element of a, a. this epsilon represent an element or member of a set so if we wish to say a particular element is not an element of uh, a so we write m epsilon we cross it a so which means m is not an element of a then we look at a cardinality of a set the number of elements in a set is called its cardinality so we look at w is a set of two four six and eight and since there are four elements in set w we say the cardinality of w is four and uh, this is denoted by n of w is equal to four so we go to the next item we look at tabular form that's a representation of sets so do we have the tabular form a set can be defined by listing the element in the set this is called tabular form so we look at some examples we have set a is 2 3 5 7 11 and 13 uh, set B is M A T H S. Then C C is set of A to C nine E. So these are examples of tabular form of defining a set. So we we'll now go to the set builder form. A set can be defined by giving the rule or property that defines the elements that make up the set this is called set builder form so some examples here we have a set x a set of x such that 0 less than x less than or equal to 10 and x is a prime number so we take uh, the first example is set x and the uh, it is a set of x such that 0 less than x less than 10 where x is a prime so they are looking at the prime numbers between 0 and 10 that's the description here so the set, next example is y a set of vowels of the english alphabet so here we look at the letters of the english alphabet and select out the vowels which make up the elements that form set y and uh, finally z is set of z such that z is an integer 
so this is which means uh, the elements of Z are whole numbers positive negative including zero that's the examples based on the description of set Z this is the end of the video thank you for watching the video I hope you enjoyed it until I come your way again goodbye